For the makers who lead, success isn't measured in promises. It's measured in results. At Rockwell Automation, our 24,000 employees across the globe focus every day on delivering business results for our customers. Because with every result achieved, we realize the promise of expanding human possibilities. That's why we're Rockwell. Our customers make products and deliver solutions that touch all of our lives. And they partner with us to realize measurable, consistent, and profitable business outcomes. Delivering the real results they and their customers depend on. The people of Rockwell and our vast production technology portfolio make a real difference in industrial production quality, speed, and efficiency. Making a difference in ramping up adequate supplies of life-saving vaccines making a difference by helping deliver vehicles that are affordable, efficient, and safe. Making a difference by engineering sustainability into every system and solution we deliver. Because at Rockwell, we believe better is possible. And the results we deliver add value for our customers every day, in every industry we serve. Our systems connect your company end-to-end -end with data-fueled insights, improving the decisions that deliver results and expanding human possibilities. Rockwell Automation. Results achieved. Hi, Justin Garski from Rockwell Automation here, your North American OEM segment manager for packaging and converting here at Pack Expo International 2022 Chicago. Uh, so behind me here, we've got what we're calling unified robot control. Uh, so in this example, we've got a, a Delta robot, which is run off of our VPL motors and our kinetics family. And then we've got a, a Kamau Scara here as well. That's also run off of a kinetics platform. And all that runs off of a single PLC, right? So we've got the iTrack, the two robots, it's all one thing, one programming environment. You don't have to worry about, hey, do I have a robot programmer? Do I have a PLC programmer? It's all one, right? So why is that interesting? Kind of takes me to topic number two. So we start talking about data. Uh, for those of you that missed the innovation stage, we'll give you the brief uh, overview here. But all this stuff is producing data in real time. So when you think about a, a motion axis, every millisecond you're getting about 200 parameters back and forth and so as an OEM you start to go okay what do I do with all this data and as an end user you say man there's all this data and I really should do something with it so things that we're talking about here smart objects uh, which is our way to collect and, and contextualize that information um, and from there we started out with kind of a baseline of uh, OEE right so how, what's your uptime what's your downtime good parts bad parts but also the thing that's more interesting to me is faults, right? So how many times has your machine faulted today? What was the duration of those faults? And then you can start to do some diagnostics backwards to figure out what's wrong with your system. So really cool data is where it's all going and it starts with, you know, logics and getting everything back to that controller. So then as we look over here behind me, uh, we've got our emulation simulation station. So. Uh, emulate 3D is our product that we're promoting there, but when I think about emulation and simulation, I think about time to certainty, right? So when we've got a machine, whether you're, again, if you're an OEM, you're building something, how do you make sure, number one, that what you're building is programmed right, sequencing right, but also as we're fighting some of the supply chain challenges, we don't have all the parts we need, maybe we don't have people where we need them, we can now start to build those machines and test them in a virtual environment, long before we've got that actual machine built. So some really cool stories around the show floor with people that have used Emulate 3D. But uh, again, I think it's really important and it helps you get, get where you wanna be faster, right? Be, be more accurate, more profitable and, and ready to go. So that's the, uh, the, the short tour of what we've got here at Pack Expo International 2022. Uh, thanks for joining us.